What's going on guys, Bao here back with some anime ninja, so let's get into this day, we're going to be checking out the plan, finally, um, it is going to help us out quite a bit, we do already have 100k, but this is just going to stack onto what we already have, and then that'll let us, um, hopefully, start getting some stuff, well, we'll probably only be able to get like a character, or if there's a multiple event that has like a character and a pet or something like that, I don't know. We'll see what happens. I mean, there's a Persian event, stuff like that as well, so... Um, plus, we do have other events that are topped on top of that, depending upon what you want to go for. And, yeah, we have, like, the gold change, which isn't the best anymore. It was nice when they actually let you go all the way up, but they don't let you do that anymore. It would be a good way if they just took that cap off. Like, it was fine for the, the first, like, 500 gold. And then if they were to just take that cap off, I think a lot more people would top up just to get that gold. Because it's a really good event, it's just they screwed it up, so there's that. We do have the Egg Smash event, which I don't really do. Uh, there are multiple stuff in this event. We do have um, accessory sets, so you can go for that. It is really expensive if you do want to go for it. There is other stuff in here. I'm not going to worry about it too much. Um, it's just not my type of event, so we're not going to worry about it. Uh, we do have this event. I'm not going to worry about it as well. It is a top-up event, which would go good with the gold change if you're going to be topping up. So, I guess there's that. Uh, we do have this event as well, which is going to be a top-up event. Uh, Granny Cat's event. Um, you do have to top up 20... No, 2,000. Okay, I was like, 20? Wait, what? 2,000 to get this. Eh, not worth it, but... If you're already topping up, then it shouldn't affect you at all. So, yeah, that's fine there. We'll get into the plan here in a second. And then, of course, we have the Tintel's Rival, which is really good if you're going to be doing the plan. Unfortunately, this one only goes up to 10k. I really wish it would increase it, like the Dragon Ball uh, Z Online event, event which uh, gives you 20k instead of 10k. So, they double it. And I wouldn't mind them doing that on here. Um, even if they do have to take away, let's say, uh, they'll take away the probably the 50 because you wouldn't need that anymore. Or maybe they leave the 50, take out 150, 300. Uh, they'll leave the 550. Or no, they'll take out, maybe they'll take out these three, then go to a thousand, take out the two, and then, you know, just to make room for the extra amounts. But I think they should do that. I wouldn't mind. It is just coupons as well. So, it's not like they're giving us something crazy or anything like that, but I feel like 20k, like the DBZ Online event, is a lot better. And then, of course, we do have this, which in that event as well, this is the same amount, so they don't really have to change this one, which just gives you basic Fury and level 7 boxes. Um, it does go up, of course. It starts out at like the lowest, which is level 4, and then it goes 7, 8, and then 2 level 8, so. Yeah, I mean, we're going to get this because we're going to be spending that much. Um, unfortunately, we're going to miss out on the extra coupons. Or maybe I'll split it up. Because uh, I was like, I'm just going to do the entire plan and get all these boxes and open up for you guys. But I think I'll just do the first 40, which will get us this. And then tomorrow I'll do the investment for the extra 10k. Uh, just to get extra coupons. Like, yeah, I don't really need them, but like look at the recent consumption event plus coupons are really good for the ninja treasure for events um other than that as well but like if you want to go for an event character ninja treasure is the best for that uh there's a ton of stuff that will work with it so we're gonna buy that because i still need ponzi um i don't need either of these although i could buy them um i'm not going to though but uh there is the flash sale, so you can look in that. There's the valued buy, which of course is going to be top up, which will incorporate into the gold change if you're going to be going through that. The other barion is going to be top up yet again, so a ton of top up events and stuff like that. Um, yeah, they could totally fix like the top up thing with like just changing some of the events back to the way they were. It's not that big a deal. I, all they have to do is keep increasing the price of the characters, which they are doing, or just keep coming out with more stuff. So. Uh, it would get people to top up a lot more because people don't top up as much as they used to um, Me included so Yeah, we did hit 18 which I think we were in the last video anyway But we'll start our way on to 19 mil especially with the extra gold we're about to get 
but here's the plan uh, tomorrow we will do the investment there's probably no need for me to make a video off of that because there's nothing else I'll be able to do besides that but they'll give us the I think it's like 9,000 something like 9,900 or 9,500 or whatever to do this but I'll spend the extra couple uh, probably on the flash sale and then get the 10k for the extra coupons but for today we have this event that we're gonna do which is the buy which is 40k so it is going to give us um, we already have a hundred and six thousand so basically we're just gonna be shy of 150k so I'll probably just make this video title like 150k because we actually might get close to that as well with the investment and stuff like that so not that far off um, but yeah it's like 147 maybe 48 depending on the investment tomorrow so um, yeah plus we get the pack as well which is level 7 so a ton of boxes is going to be exchanged um, so let's buy this get it out of the way we'll get 4k a day for 20 days so of gold coming back in that means we're gonna be able to buy characters sets get um older characters we want we can actually buy two older characters instead of buying one newer one if we wanted to um ton of stuff we could do so and i do have to start working on getting sets and getting characters and accessories and stuff like that so uh ton ton of choices um and then of course we're probably gonna have to wait another like two to three months for the next plan so we do have to choose what we want to spend it on carefully because we're like if we go for a character we're only going to be able to buy one character because we have to keep i i say i like to keep 50k like even though like you just seen me buy it it was only 40 i always like to keep an extra 10k because this has gone up one time before where it's been 50. you never know they could throw it up to 60 if they wanted to so it's always better to save a little bit more just in case and for me i like to always save 50. so even though let's say we have 150 i will have to save 50 so i have 100k to spend um which is it's just a little bit less than that but basically i have 100k to spend that's like a character and then maybe a set or i can get another character or a pet or multiple pets i kind of want to get new which is the pet in the um Persian event so I might buy like three of those or something so yeah because that would help us out with this just trade out all these three characters for new um but yeah that, that gives us room to mess around or I could buy two characters which uh currently all my characters could re be replaced besides the vanguard unless I mean we're gonna be getting a pretty good vanguard but um I kind of want to replace that last so I would rather replace everything else before I start figuring out uh, what Vanguard like I'm gonna buy so we'll replace these first and then we'll worry about the Vanguard so we're probably gonna replace Pain and Conan, Sasuke and Itachi and then or maybe the Assaulter first it doesn't matter e either of these three can go uh, I do have to get a healer though unless I want to keep Sasuke and Itachi um, or is it Pain and Conan I forgot which one heals one of them heals I think they both heal actually I don't know I don't really remember their skill offhand but um well I know Sasuke and Itachi heal but they're so old now so yeah I'm gonna have to find a different healer uh growth rate and heal all allies for 150 percent so that's really good though 150 what is this one uh it's not this why does it show me talent attack on enemies 330 growth rate 360 percent blind we need that i guess so we're gonna probably i can go with hinata and neji actually or i can go with guy and um guy and rock lee maybe i don't know there's multiple characters that i can go for uh yeah there's no heal on this one but yeah we can start switching out these guys and then we can start going for sets accessories and stuff like that as well so ton of stuff to work on um currently at 15k let's actually grab these which is not really that much honestly uh like on the dbz online one you get so many coupons back and i really wish i would increase that honestly having it up to 20 would be so nice um especially if you're buying like the characters cost so much now that like 10k is nothing like i could spend 10k refreshing to get the character so yeah i really wish i would increase that um like i said tomorrow we'll do the investment get the extra coupons from there uh, i do have to go do all my dailies um 
don't think I'm missing anything else. Um, we're still working on our potency as well, if you guys are wondering, uh, which is barely level seven. I don't know if I want to, I want to max these guys out to the second reincarnation. I could, and the only reason I kind of want to is just because, um, I could transfer it over and then they'll stay at the second reincarnation instead of like transferring over now, they'll lose the 39 levels. So I don't know. Let me know what you guys think. Should I just max them out real quick? So, uh, cause we're going to switch this character out. It doesn't like, we're not going to keep it, but like if I inherit, let's say we like these guys, like they stayed at the level they were at, but it's just the, they lose, like, if I go to her now, where is she? Um, like, even though she's reincarnated level 50, I don't think I can actually reincarnate her. Can I? Can I still reincarnate her? I don't know. She doesn't have the levels anymore. I don't know. I've never actually tried this. It would be 100, though. I wonder if I can. I'm kind of scared to, though. Can I? No, you can't. Okay, so yeah, you would have to reincarnate them first. So that's what I kind of want to do with uh, Pain and Conan. So, hmm. I mean, they're already level. Their their level's good. It's just getting them to 150, which I have enough potency. Like, let's see. I'm pretty sure I'll max out. Or right, let's take that one back. Actually, where is it? Damn. Never mind. I don't even have enough, apparently. Hmm. Maybe I don't have enough. I will lose a little bit, like if I, cause I could use all this for the next character, but I will lose a little bit. But they'll be those, they'll be at second reincarnated, and I kind of want to reincarnate my, reincarnate my main. I don't know what to do, honestly. Is it worth it to do it just to to do it? Cause they're almost, they're like 10, 11 levels. They're 11 levels off of being done. So, ah, uh, I don't know. Um, yeah, that's basically about it. We do have the boxes and stuff like that. So let's actually go use all of this, get it out of the way. So that way we don't have to worry about it. Um, we do have the gold now, so we can actually buy characters and stuff like that. So, uh, we'll see what we're going to be buying and stuff. I haven't decided yet. But I do want to reincarnate, so I haven't decided if I'm going to just finish off Pain and Conan and then we can go from there. We got some level sevens here. Let's see what we get. So we got a few couple. A couple of them are pretty good. Level eight force. Not bad. Um, yeah, I haven't decided if I want to finish them off because I have quite a bit of potency. And the only reason I'm saving up points is to do my main, but getting to the third one is going to take forever. Plus, I'm not even to level 50 on this yet, so, and I doubt I'm going to get it, get it anytime soon because it's going to take freaking ages. Why is this not stacking? That's just weird. Um, yeah, that's basically about it. I do have probably a ton of jade that I can actually do considering we just used a ton of it. I got a ton of level sevens. We will get two level eights tomorrow for doing the investment uh, from the Centile's arrival, so we do have that. But um, let me know what you guys think I should go for. Um, characters, I could actually start leveling up some S weapons as well, so that require gold, of course. Like look, these are all ten, so I could start upgrading those. Um, I don't know how much extra do I have one that's not level ten. Are all these level 10? Let me see. No. Let's find a random one. I have 890. So yeah, I could actually upgrade some of these if I wanted to. Huh. I don't know. Let me know what you guys think here. My characters, if you guys are wondering. Uh, we are definitely going to be switching out the two supports and the assaulter. And then Vanaguard will be last, of course. And then we also have to switch out the sets and accessories. And then we will be also getting pets. So I think I'll go for... Uh, if I can swing it, maybe two characters and a pet, or if I can maybe get a pet and a 
character at the same time, that'd be nice. If not, then I'll just get it like a character and maybe three pets. Um, and then just wait for another plan, which is like another two to three months away. So going to be a while, but I could do that. So yeah, I'm not too sure what I want to go with just yet, but I think that's going to be about it for this one. Thank you guys for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Hopefully you guys saved up enough for the plan. And yeah, we'll talk to you guys later.